What a great day, beautiful day here at the Waterworks. Really had a great experience today with the students uh, getting excited about things that many people take for granted, and that's reliable public water supply. I think they were surprised to learn that Philadelphia did this nearly 200 years ago and the impact it had on the community. The Fairmount Dam, when it was built, was the largest in the world. It was built in 1821. I like the fact that they build the waterworks um, just to purify the water for the city. The Philadelphia Water Department draws all of our water from the Schuylkill and the Delaware Rivers. Upstream of us, there's at least three major cities that we'll talk about outside that do the same thing. Draw their water from the river, use it, pollute it, drink it, whatever they're doing with it, and then clean it and send it back. And then it comes down to us. There's so many different things that came up just in the tour today where I heard students saying, gee, I could do that, gee, wouldn't that be interesting? Explore STEM Philly has always been as rewarding for those of us that uh, help arrange it as hopefully it is for the students. Today I learned that how water uh, gets around the city was pretty cool. I think it's really great whenever the students are able to see something very concrete and whenever they're able to visit a site, a historical site, an important site, and just see the actual machinery, see how it's done, see how it started, how it developed. I think that's always helpful to the students. And then it's hard for them to believe we get our water from the Schuylkill. The clear water that comes out of the sink is that same murky green brown water that you see in the river. Um, so that's always really great too. So I think for those reasons, it was, it was a great experience for them. I always use the expression that a lot of times the work of engineers is taken for granted because all of the things that, many of the things that engineers provide, we just assume are going to be there. We've got the turbine here on the other side of this wall. I want everybody to peek in and see the wet well. This is where one of our water wheels would have been. All of those things are things that engineers do as a practical application of scientific principles that become then useful tools that all of us take for granted each and every day. So hopefully we'll raise a little bit of an awareness for you. Some of you may become engineers, others of you may become scientists, others of you may become the folks that fix the pumps that uh, we use to pump the water to the top of the hill. Uh, there's a lot of programs here at the Waterworks that introduce people to various career opportunities that you might have in a STEM-related field. So that's our goal for the day. This is the first municipal water pumping station in America. So they used to pull water from the Schuylkill up into, the, up into that room right next to you and then it used to come up to the art museum, which used to be the reservoir. So that's the technology. It actually is a, a historical landmark, and it's also an engineering marvel. People used to come from all over the world to see this building. If you ask some of your grandparents, they may have come here and swum in the pool. There was a pool here, and there was also an aquarium that a lot of people used to visit. Um, and then they boarded it up again because there was not a use for it. And uh, about five years ago, we ended up deciding to open up a restaurant. I have three kids of my own and uh, just trying to teach them now the importance of, you know, recycling and cleaning up after themselves um, is, really, is really important. So hopefully you guys take that seriously and do that at home and in school and uh, as you guys start your families of your own. So thank you all for coming out today. So I wanted to say thank you for coming today. I hope this has been helpful as you guys are piecing together different science and engineering um, career paths and different things that even you might be interested in. Maybe you learned today that you're interested in some of these things and you hadn't realized beforehand. So thank you for coming. Enjoy the Waterworks restaurant. Tell me how it is. I've never been. But I hear good things.